Welcome to Midpoint and Bisector Exercises, Example 2. From this diagram, we want to be able to answer the following questions. The first question is, what is the angle bisector of angle TPR? Here's angle TPR. Notice the two adjacent angles that would make up angle TPR have one hash mark through them, and therefore angle RPS and angle SPT have the same measure and therefore are congruent. And so segment PS would have to be the angle bisector of angle TPR. Number 12, P is the midpoint of what two segments? Looking at point P, notice that segment QP has two hash marks and segment PT also has two hash marks. So those two segments are equal to each other and therefore P would be the midpoint of segment QT. Notice that P is also the midpoint of segment VS because segment VP has one hash mark and so does segment PS. Number 13, what is the measure of angle QPR? Notice this angle has this little square which tells us this angle measures 90 degrees. Number 14, what is the measure of angle TPS? Angle TPS is this angle here. And from the previous question, we know that angle QPR is 90 degrees. It's also a linear pair with angle RPT. So angle RPT would have to be 90 degrees. And since segment PS bisects angle RPT, if we divide 90 degrees by two, angle RPS and angle SPT would have to be 45 degrees. Now let's take a look at number 15 and 16 together. Number 15 asks, how does segment VS relate to segment QT? So here's segment VS and here's segment QT. And then the next question asks, how does QT relate to VS? Well, they intersect at point P and notice that point P is the midpoint for segment QT and it's also the midpoint for segment VS. So the two segments are each other's bisectors. VS bisects QT and QT bisects VS. Notice how I'm not saying perpendicular bisector because they don't form a right angle, but they do bisect each other. Number 17, is segment PU a bisector? If so, of what? Here's segment PU. And notice how it does intersect segment QT and segment VS at the midpoint. So it is a bisector of those two segments. And the last question, what is the measure of angle QPV? Here's angle QPV. And notice that angle QPV and angle TPS are vertical angles. And we said back on question 14 that angle TPS was 45 degrees. Therefore, angle QPT is also 45 degrees. I hope you found this example helpful. Thank you for watching.